go. So today's an exciting day, I'm going on a road trip. So since I started this project, I have a 25 horsepower motor that I've been wanting to put on this boat, but it's set up for remote controls, which means it's got you know cables and wires and all that stuff going to a steering wheel and to the shifter and throttle. But for this little boat, I don't want that set up. I want a tiller. So I've been shopping for a tiller, but they're like 200 bucks just for a tiller, the arm, plus $30 shipping. And two months, maybe three months for it to get here because it's coming from Japan and it's got to go through customs. So I've been looking for a parts motor to be able to scavenge a tiller off of. And instead of a parts motor, I found a running motor, so we're going to get it. So the drive today is all the way from Pine Island up to Gainesville and back. It's gonna be about 10 hours. Worth it, better be worth it. First stop along the way is to the bank. Gotta get some cash. Bridge. Hey. 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 All right, I'm at the bank. Let's go get some money. Ah, so I had to go inside. ATM rules have changed. Let's get back on the road. Done. I would have done it for 500. I would have done it for the experience. All right, so all the negotiations were done. The motor's in the back of the truck. I didn't bother videoing any of it because I just didn't want to uh, put him on the spot or anything like that. Yeah, seems like a pretty good deal. And stop and get something to eat and start my drive home. And I'll see you at home and I'll show you the motor. this thing out you never even got to see it yet look at that there she is we have here a 2004 tohatsu go ahead and drag her out to the end of the tailgate here i'll pull that trim bracket off get her ready to mount on a homemade motor stand Hmm, 
It's off. Not the right way, but it's off. No. Yep, pull towards you. Pull. There you go. What? That. We're gonna pull it. I just cranked her over, she fired right up, but doesn't want to keep running. Tells me the carburetor needs a quick cleaning, which is not hard to do. So we're gonna do that. I'll probably pull the uh, fuel pump clean it out too. I could smell rotten gas in this thing. One carb clean late daughter. That wasn't too bad at all. Carburetor is done, put back on. She fired right up, running great. Tweaked a couple little things on it as far as the mixture and the timing and stuff like that. And she's idling pretty good. Check it out. And I just pop a button and... That's awesome. Can't beat it. Well, it has gone and started raining on me. So yeah, as you can see, I got her running. She's running really well i can't wait to put it through its paces but to do that i got to put it on the boat and to put it on the boat i got to keep working on the boat i really appreciate you hanging out with me on this one and i hope to see you in the next one